Pakistani Taliban chief promises to hit the U.S. Pakistan's Taliban chief promised to tax some major U.S. cities in a video apparently dated early April and released following the weekend's car bomb attempt in New York City. It followed reports of another video which a group apparently tried to take credit for that attempted strike. U.S. authorities have played down the potential connection between the Pakistani militant network and the car bomb attempt in New York's Times Square, saying the group does not have the global infrastructure to carry out such a strike, at least not yet. However, the Pakistani Taliban are allied with Al-Qaeda and other groups which could expand their reach. The latest video is about nine minutes long and features Masood, the Pakistani Taliban chief, according to Intel Center, a U.S. based group that monitors militant media. Masood does not specifically mention New York, but says he is speaking on April 4th of this year and promises that. God willing, very soon in some days or a month's time, the Muslim community will see the fruits of most successful attacks on the USA. Masood also refutes earlier Pakistani and American claims that he died in a U.S. missile strike in January, a belief Pakistani intelligence officials recently revised. The video follows a second shorter clip in which the group appears to claim responsibility for the attempted car bomb in New York City. According to the Site Intelligence Group, another monitoring organization, in the one minute, eleven second video allegedly released by the Pakistani Taliban, the militant group says the attack is revenge for the death of its leader and the recent slaying of Al-Qaeda and Iraq leaders. The site, or SITE, a U.S.-based terrorist tracking organization, first uncovered the video on YouTube. The tape, which later appeared to have been removed from the website, made no specific reference to the attack in New York, nor does it mention that the location or that it was a car bomb. New York City's police commissioner said there's no evidence of a Taliban link to the failed car bomb. At the start of the video, a text in gold letters on black background celebrates the jaw-breaking blow to Satan's USA. As the speaker delivers the message, images of the slain militants mentioned flash across the screen. English subtitles are provided at the bottom. The speaker says the attack also avenges U.S. drone strikes in Pakistani tribal areas that target Taliban leaders hiding there. The Pakistani Taliban is one of Pakistan's largest and deadliest militant groups. It has strong links to Al-Qaeda and is based in the northwest, close to the Afghan border. The group has carried out scores of bloody attacks inside Pakistan in recent years, mostly against Pakistani targets, but it has made no secret of its hatred toward the United States. Last year, its then commander vowed to amaze everyone in the world with an attack on Washington or even the White House. The claim comes a day after police in New York found a potentially powerful car bomb that apparently began to detonate but did not explode in a smoking sport utility vehicle in Times Square, a precursor, a prelude of things to come. And yes, these are more signs. The U.S. drone attacks in Afghanistan and Pakistan 
and anywhere else or everywhere else that they use them are causing a lot of hatred a lot of anger towards the United States and they will seek revenge and what happens so what happens when they get a nuclear weapon or an atomic device which is not just a matter of if but a matter of when because it's time for all prophecy to be fulfilled Revelation chapter 17 15 and he saith unto me the waters which thou saw where the whore stands are peoples and multitudes and nations and languages 16 and the ten horns which thou saw upon the beast these shall hate the whore and shall make her desolate and naked and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire that reaches unto the soul 17 for God has put in their hearts to fulfill his will and to agree and give their kingdom unto the beast until the words of God shall be fulfilled 18 and the woman which thou saw is that great great city which reigns over the leaders of the earth Revelation 18 and after these things I saw another angel come down from heaven having great power and the earth was lightened with his glory. 2. And he cried mightily with a strong voice, saying, That place like unto Babylon, the great is fallen, is fallen, and is become the habitation of devils, and the hold of, of every foul spirit, and the cage of every unclean and hateful bird. 3. For all nations have drunk of the wine of the wrath of a fornication, and the leaders of the earth have committed fornication with her, and the merchants of the earth are waxed rich through the abundance of her delicacies. 4. And I heard another voice from heaven saying, Come out of her, my people, that you be not partakers of her sins, and that you receive not of her plagues. 5. For her sins have reached unto heaven, and God has remembered her inequities. 6. Reward her even as she rewarded you, and double unto her, double according to her works. In the cup which she has filled, fill to her double. 7. How much she has glorified herself, and lived deliciously. So much torment and sorrow give her, for she says in her heart, I sit as a queen, and am no widow, and shall see no sorrow. 8. Therefore shall her plagues come in one day, death and mourning and famine, and she shall be utterly burned with fire that reaches into the soul, for strong is the Lord God who judges her. 9. And the leaders of the earth who have committed fornication and lived deliciously with her shall bewail her and lament for her and they shall see the smoke of her burning. 10. Standing afar off for the fear of her torment saying Alas, alas, that great city likened to Babylon that mighty city for in one hour is that judgment come and these are more signs